What's going on guys? I'm here today to talk to you about the site manufacturing industry, their lead times, and one of the main companies that I don't think anyone's put a video out on yet with their compatibility to the new inline systems that these companies are offering. So guys, stay tuned, you're not gonna wanna miss it. All right guys, so like I said in the intro, I wanna first talk to you about the site manufacturing industry and their lead times. I know a lot of guys are looking for like an Excel landslide or a uh, spot hog, uh, triple stack or fast eddy, uh, XL, the dovetail and whatnot to fit the new Matthews and et cetera, so on and so on and you just can't get it. Uh, now if you were to order a site today from either Excel or spot hog, you're looking at four to six months out. And with this day and age, I'm gonna take the latter every day of the week. So I would count on six months, probably even longer. Who knows if you can even count on that. So with that being said, six months from today, which is March 8th, is gonna be September. And that is way too late. Um, I don't care what you say. Um, that's just too late to get a sight on your bow and start shooting. Uh, the season's already here. So uh, there are other directions you can go it's not the end be all with uh, Excel Landslide or Spot Hog. They're not the only companies out there. So I do want to talk to you about one company that I don't think anyone's put a video out on yet as far as their compatibility with the inline systems or just any site that they have that just mounts on the side of a riser too. Uh, so with that being said, that site company I'm talking about is the HHA. So this is the short bar that they came out with that is compatible with the new bridge lock technology uh, inline system that Matthews came out with. So this is four to five inch bar. Um, as you can see, it's the furthest setting in and it's probably only sticking in past this riser towards the cables about an inch or so. Uh, super great, clean, uh, sleek looking sight. I really like it. This is the single pin uh, Tetra tournament edition. Now they're um, is a Tetra Max and the only difference with the Tetra and the Tetra Max is that the Tetra Max has a removable wheel and it comes with two wheels so you could have a setup for say 3D or Target and you could also have a setup for hunting without having to reconfigure everything you can just swap the wheel on and off which is super nice um, so with that being with me saying um, 3D and Target I'm meaning like different poundage and different arrows which is going to change your sight tape so you can just take it on and off, it's super easy. Uh, you don't have to mess with everything. Um, so I know people have been complaining about how certain site companies are fitting in this new bridge lock technology. So I wanted to show you how that fit in here with the HHA. And it is probably the best fitting site that fits in that bridge lock technology. And I'm even saying that above the site that Excel and Matthew made for this system. Um, so as you can see, I think it fits better than the Excel site that was made for it. Um, no play at all. I mean, there's nothing there. If you put in like a spot hog, um, you're gonna have a, a really good amount of play. Uh, the Excel is not bad at all. It's, it was made for this, so it's, it still fits perfect. I'm just saying this HHA, um, it fits better. So. That was one thing I just wanted to show you guys real quick before I put that one up. Um, and you can obviously get this in a four pin, three pin, um, 10 thousandths, 19 thousandths, rheostat, non rheostat, whatever. I just, I wanted to show you, this is a single pin that I have on my bow right. All right guys, so this is the HHA that's compatible uh, with the Hoyt inline system. As you can see, it attaches right to the Picatinny rail off the front of the Hoyt's riser. Um, super clean, uh, sturdy sight that they came out with. Perfectly compatible, no issues whatsoever. Uh, this is the Tetra Tournament Edition. Like I mentioned, the same one that's on the Matthews, not the Tetra Max. The only difference in the Tetra and the Tetra Max is that removable wheel like I talked about before. So just wanted to show you guys that option as far as the, the one that HHA has for the Hoyt inline system as well. So if you guys are looking for a site for this spring or Target or uh, just even this upcoming hunting season with the lead times that these other companies are having right now, look into HHA. It's a great company. I'm not affiliated with them whatsoever. 
Um, I just think people are freaking out trying to get a spot hog or an Excel or one of these other companies that uh, there's just no way it's going to happen. And why take that risk when you could get a sight on your bow uh, within the next couple weeks, get shooting, have plenty of time um, shooting rounds through that bow and uh, get comfortable with it. So guys, thanks for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe, like, and thanks for the watch.